There is a way now, Tom. We get our friends to roll their sleeves up and get to work. It's certainly a good idea. If I could take a look at the place, I could probably tell what it requires to fix it up. How much paint, how many hours of work, that's what I came to ask you to do, Malcolm. If you would supervise the refurbishing, I'll find the people to help do it. I'll help too, Mr. Baker. I can get some of my friends to go around the neighborhood and collect the furniture we need. I'll help. Tomorrow, yes. We'll meet tomorrow morning right here. Can we help? I'd really like to. Sure. We might need you to come through with your friends, Robbie. Not just to go around the neighborhood asking for furniture, but to help with the paint job. That's back-breaking work and may be too much for us. I'll do it. I'll talk to them. And tomorrow morning, we'll all meet here to discuss the plan? Tomorrow morning, it is. <laughs> I'd like you to meet my friend Malcolm Stewart. Uh, Malcolm, this is Joanne Thompson. Hello, Joanne. Nice to meet you. My pleasure, Malcolm. And this is Abe Lucas. You must remember Abe. He ran the drugstore and used to play drums with the jazz band on weekends. Oh, sure I do. Hi, Abe. Hello, Mr. Stewart. <laughs> Malcolm, please. Hello, Malcolm. <laughs> Look, sit down, sit down. Have some coffee. And I've got some delicious Danish pastry for you. Where's your grandson, Robbie, and his friend, Alexandra? Weren't they going to be here this morning? I thought so, too. Uh, I'm surprised they're not here. Robbie left early this morning to meet Alexandra. Frankly, I thought they'd be here, but... It's okay. I'm sure they meant well, but they probably had other things on their minds. I understand you used to be in the construction business, Malcolm. I was indeed. I wonder if you would take a look at the old library and make sure that it is in good condition so that we don't have to worry about any structural problems. Well, when can I do that? I'd be happy to. We've got permission to go inside the old building during the week, on Tuesday or Wednesday. Well, that's fine with me. I can do it either day. That would be very helpful. I think the building just needs a good cleaning. And a good paint job. Then we have to furnish it. I wish Robbie and Alexandra had come to this meeting. They had some ideas about getting the place fixed up. Perhaps they'll show up. In the meantime, let me give you some additional thoughts and ideas I have. Okay. Go ahead, Joanne. As I said, mostly the building just needs a good cleaning and painting. This place can be developed with one real intergenerational program. That's an idea I like. A community center with the kinds of programs that fit everyone. And programs that don't leave anyone out. It's asking a lot. But we can't do it without talking to the young people, finding out what they want. If only Robbie and Alexandra were here. Don't be upset, Malcolm. We'll have a chance to talk to them later. It's not like Robbie. If he says he's going to be here, he's here. I wonder what the problem is. 